if you're playing on an outdated PC your dad found in the back of his garage, no worries. Right here you will find a solution to this problem. So sit back and open your brain reservoir, because here you will get a real increase in FPS. Update your graphics card drivers. I know you might have heard this before so many times, but I have to mention it as some people don't update their GPU drivers. Updating your GPU drivers will help you fix any bugs with your graphics card software. This will help you with all the latest performance optimization that your GPU manufacturer has made. So, all you have to do is go to the official website of your graphics card manufacturer and download the latest drivers. Windows settings. Windows optimization is very important because Windows has a lot of unnecessary functions that load your system. If you want to get a more detailed video about Windows optimization, then watch these videos. The link to the Windows optimization video will be in the description. Well, all you have to do is just copy my settings. Low Specs Experience. So let me explain first, what is the Low Specs Experience? Low Specs Experience is an in-house developed game optimization tool designed to optimize your favorite games for maximum possible performance. With 8 optimization methods and 3 optimization modes, it is the ultimate PC video game optimization tool suitable for various hardware specifications. First of all, download and install the Low Specs Experience on your computer. The official website of the program will be in the description below this video. Once the download is completed, extract the downloaded zip file. Once it's done, start it from the newly created desktop shortcut and select the optimization catalog. From this drop-down menu select your game and then press load the optimization package. Low Specs Experience will now automatically check if the game version currently installed is supported by this optimization. If it is, press OK, and the optimization control panel will load. When the optimization control panel loads, simply select the method of optimization and the resolution you would like to render your game at. Once you decide which optimization method and resolution you are going to use, press the Execute Optimization button and then launch your game. Process Lasso Process Lasso is a great tool for gamers because it allows you to automatically manage and optimize your computer's resources for gaming. This means that your games will run smoother and faster and you'll be able to enjoy them more. Additionally, Process Lasso can help you avoid gaming-related problems such as stuttering, lag, and crashes. By default, Process Lasso automatically adjusts process priorities and CPU affinities to improve system responsiveness and prevent freezes. You can also manually configure Process Lasso to your liking. For example, you can set certain processes to always run at a higher or lower priority than others. Ultimate Performance Power Plan Ultimate Performance Mode is a power plan in Windows, which is designed for workstations and aims to optimize the performance of the operating system. Open a command prompt as administrator. In the description below this video I will leave this command, you just need to copy and paste it there and press enter. Collapse the command prompt and go to the power supply settings section and select the power plan with maximum performance. Optimize in game settings and resolution. 
every game will allow you to lower your resolution, which will help your GPU output more frames per second. Not playing in a native resolution can make the game you are playing look a bit rubbish, however, this step may give you the frame boost you need for a smooth experience. Aside from the resolution, you can also change your in-game settings. Lowering your presets or finding an optimization guide for a specific game will again allow you to push a higher frame rate. It isn't just graphical detail you can tweak in the settings either, look into anti-aliasing and other game-specific settings like draw distance to get your FPS higher. Getting lag spikes online? For those that love multiplayer gaming, there is nothing worse than lag spikes. If your internet isn't particularly good anyway small things like streaming video or using Wi-Fi can have a big impact on the lag you experience in-game. Ideally, you need to stop streaming whenever you play, and if you can, connect via an Ethernet connection for a more solid experience online. Consider upgrades. If you are at the stage where these tweaks are making little difference, it could be time for an upgrade. Upgrading is a costly affair and recent stock issues have really made it a bit of a headache for gamers out there. Upgrading your CPU and GPU are going to cost you the most money but they will obviously make the most difference for gaming. What you may be surprised about is that a small RAM or storage upgrade can also have a reasonable effect without impacting your bank balance too much. If you are still rocking of HDD, please buy an SSD, it is going to make your gaming life much easier. With an SSD, your Windows loading time will be reduced massively, as will any game installed onto it. For example, player Unknown's Battlegrounds on an HDD took anywhere from 45 to 60 seconds, when transferred to SSD loading time was reduced to under 10 seconds. So you can clearly see the benefits. If you are still on 8GB of RAM but have a half-decent system, doubling up to 16GB could be an affordable way to get a small boost. Also watch these videos about improving PC performance. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel.